Let's take a tour of Gateway to the World Library. Hi there, I'm Mrs. Sandoval, your librarian. And this is Mrs. Garza, also your librarian. Let's go inside and take a look around the library. Five of us work here in the library. Mrs. Elizondo, Mrs. Hinojosa, myself, Ms. Garza, and Ms. Mireles. And we'd like to make the library a fun place for our students. First on our tour is the circulation desk, also known as the information desk, where you can check out books and equipment or return them you can pick up copies that you printed, or you can ask for help. And here's the book drop also located at the circulation desk. But if you're returning equipment, we ask that you turn it into one of our library staff members. And how do you find the books in our library? Simply by looking at one of our two card catalog stations, and you can search by subject, author, or title of the book. You can also do a search online. Our catalog is available 24-7. Not sure if you're in the right section of the library? Always look up, we have signs that will guide you. Did you know that our library has over 40,000 printed books? 50% of them are fiction and 50% of them are nonfiction. Our fiction books are in alphabetical order by the author's last name. You can find the fiction books by looking up and seeing the letters of the alphabet. Our nonfiction books are in order numerically. The library has numerous pieces of equipment for you to check out, such as laptops, Nook tablets, projectors, cameras and tripods, green screens, headphones, memory cards, stylus pens, microphone stands and speakers, USBs, adapters, and charging cables. Your ID card is very important if you want to check out books or equipment from the library, so don't forget it. This is Overdrive, our online library, where you can find ebooks, audiobooks, and videos. Did you know that your summer reading can be found here? And you never have to worry about an ID card or overdue books. This is the quick printing station where you save a lot of time because you don't have to log in. But you do need to have your assignment on a USB drive because these computers aren't connected to the internet. And speaking of printing, all black and white copies are free and any color printing is 10 cents per side and you must remember to select color printer from the printer options. We have a wide variety of magazines that you can look at in the library or even check out and take home. We also have a makerspace area where you can be creative. The library has 20 tables and 120 computers where students can do their work. Plus, we have several areas where students can sit comfortably to do their work. One last thing, the library recycles, so please do your part to help our Earth. That concludes our tour of the library. We sure hope to see you soon. Until then, take care.